Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Phantom Rave. Uh, if you're just joining us, this is a game about a little girl who has... Who... I, I had like a joke going here, and I completely forgot it. Oh yeah, it's a little girl who is cheated by people all the time, and has no friends. No, all her friends are dead. Uh, screw it, it doesn't matter. You know what, the joke's dead, I killed it. I, I ruined everything. <laughs> Oops. So we got a letter from Castile, who is sad because she has no money. They worked so hard for me, and I can't do anything to thank them. I'm sorry, Mona. Her letter is super depressing. So sad. Thank you for listening, though. Good luck with your jobs, Castile. Castile. Poor girl. She sounds depressed. Yeah, just a little bit. How much do you think the medicine costs? It's probably expensive, huh? Probably, but buying Castile's medicine wouldn't make her happy. You know she'd wouldn't blame herself though? for causing trouble and just get more depressed. Okay, maybe a little bit. You're right. All her friends are dead. That was the joke. That was the punchline. <laughs> I'm so sad I ruined it. Uh oh, idea. What? How is that a good idea at all? Wouldn't he just steal all her shit? So she doesn't feel alone. Hmm, I see. You're probably right. Okay then, let's go to the Isle of Healing Water. Oh boy. Okay, let's actually do it then. Boom. Uh, no. <gasps> Morona, Ash, you came to visit? No, we came to offload yep. a like mentally ill monster on you. Nobody answered the door. <laughs> in. I hope that's okay. Oh, it's fine. Mom and Dad are at work on another island. I've caused so much trouble. That isn't true. Your parents love you and they're willing to work hard for you. You aren't any trouble at all. But I am. It's my fault that Faded left home too. Who the hell's that? Faded. Yes, my brother. He left a long That's time ago. That's a dumb ago, name so for a brother. I don't remember him very well. Your brother? Oh, you brought a cute little friend. Oh yeah, we just brought monsters in your home. And figured we'd just leave them here. Why not? Responsible things to do, right? And then suddenly everyone was missing. Castile was dead. Blood on all the walls. This and all the great. valuables gone. Actually... Morona confessed honestly, admitting she had lost the necklace. I am so sorry. Hmm, I wonder what Putty did with the necklace. That's a good question. You aren't mad? Why? It wasn't your fault. It was his Besides, fault. I don't Kill think him. Putty meant any harm. He'll probably return it after he's done playing with it. I doubt that. Whew, I was worried you wouldn't want to be my friend anymore. Oh, Morona. Castile, I have a favor to ask. Oh? What is it? Can you look after Putty for me? I'm afraid he'll run away while we're gone. Everybody else I know is dead. Oh, sure. It's been really lonely here, so I'm sure it'll be fine. Thanks, Castile. I'm just glad there's something I can do. It feels good to help. I mean, you can't really watch him that well. Totally like, if he wanders outside of the room, he's gone. That's right. 
Putty can't handle Morona's cooking for much longer. <laughs> Uh-oh. What? You're mean, Ash. My cooking's not that bad. If you piss off Morona, does she can find you to poop? Make pasta, then. Or something? Like, is, she, is that all she can do to get back at you? Is just to confine you to something awful? Does that really do anything? I hope you're ready for a long trip. We're going to Mount Kazan in the Vermilion region. I mean, he's a ghost. He doesn't have to do anything. Mount Kazan, huh? I wonder what he just kind of phase there. out. Mount you're the Kazan one that has to take the trip. So it must be pretty hot there. Client's name is Cauldron. Haven't we heard that name before? Yeah, you're thinking of the big bowl you make soup in? We'll find out. Let's go! Alright, now, if I remember correctly, not only is there one more freaking cutscene, But the stuff in this chapter oh, should be our levels. Thank you for coming. Maronikins? You were at Sienna's. That's right. I'm Cauldron. Sorry about the other day. I hope you'll forgive me. Not at all I'll a trap. Admit, I underestimated you. You really did school my ravens back on the island of evil. I can just imagine one little girl beating down all the fighting beasts. I'll bet it was awesome. Thank you. <laughs> I guess. So definitely is that not a trap. Evil phantom guy here with you. Ash is not evil. Cool. He's the real deal. <laughs> freaks me out. <laughs> you look rather calm. I can't let stuff like that bother me, or I'd never survive in this business. You can't judge others. I don't care if someone's possessed, a phantom, or even a scrabbit, as long as he does his job. What is that no, guy in the background doing? Scrimmage. He's just there. Just chilling out in his overalls, with his fro, so, and his tools, to do, Mr. and his mirror on his chest. Oh, right, right. I almost forgot about that. Well, I've got a problem. I own this island, but some whack job showed up saying it belongs to nature. According to my men, he's going on about the rights of rare monsters and Habitation or something. The rights of rare monsters. I bet I know that who it familiar. is. Why don't you hire ravens to take care of it? Ravens are too expensive and messy. Besides, I wanted to see you, Marona Kittens. Oh, um. He's just teasing you. <laughs> oh, you are too cute, Marodikins. I really don't like that name. There's something about it that anyway, bothers me. That guy's around somewhere. Track him down and get rid of him for me, ASAP. Nobody spells it out. Everybody just says ASAP. All right, finally. Oh no, one more cutscene. <laughs> oh, hey, look. It's exactly who I thought it would be. You guys Never give up, do you? I told you, as long as I breathe, I will protect monsters in need. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I didn't realize it was Miss Morona, honorary member of Human Activists for Rare Monsters. Well, I never Hard. joined, but I thought I'd find you here. What brings you to Mount Kazan? Are you here to support my protest against these harsh living conditions? No, the complete actually, opposite. I'm here to stop your protest. Why are they just like? What? You'd betray the sacred oaths you swore when you first joined. Giant human chunks of steel sticking out of this mountain. 
you keep saying like I can I can accept these steel bridges in front of us. The girders making a bridge is fine. Why is there like a girder sticking out of the earth behind her? That's why Chromas can't be trusted. You're all slaves to the almighty Bordeaux. Since it's come to this, I'll have to fight you with the very monsters you wish to destroy. That seems fair. Like, look, there's a pipe sticking out of the earth. For someone who wants to protect monsters, you sure don't treat them with much respect. There's a bunch dropped in the volcano there. So, hiding behind phantoms is your game, is it? Kazan monsters, I choose you! Yep. It's an appropriate reference. Stop! I don't want to fight! Listen to her. If this man leaves the island, you can go back to your normal lives. What? Are you implying that I'm the one disrupting this serene natural habitat? Yes. Yep. How dare you! I'm President Canary of the Human Activists for Rare Monsters! Harm. Harm. Okay. Ooh, Charlie's a pretty good one. Uh, what else do we got? I don't see anything super exciting. Bombs and bricks are pretty cool to pick up, but I'll probably grab the trolley with the Zahando. Oh, I still never named Vulcan. Oh well, I'll get to it. Um, he's like 18. What are they? They're all like level 30. 30, 30, 35, 30, 30, 34. Yeah, okay. So they're about our level. Oops. Harvest in the rock. Uh, the Let's rat go. in there. And then we want to move to the bridge. And... Don't really have anybody we can, like, get some int on. Nothing really in-wise anywhere. Um, so what's reducing us the least? Like 10% there. And we'll take one of these guys. Sure, the heliotrope go. one. Might as well confine somebody else here. Let's go. And I think I will confine Akimu there. I don't know how much she can reach over there, but we'll try. Alright, what are you weak to? Fire, huh? Not by much, though. Maybe I'll just haste somebody. Well, what about you? What are you weak to? Win, that's a little easier to work with. Do, 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 do. Bang. Oh god, I'm doing it again, aren't I? Shouting bang all the time. I feel like he's gonna do a whole lot, so just wait. Uh, he's weak to fire. He's not really. Yeah, that was a terrible idea. Smacking Marauder for damage. Should probably make sure I can find a healer to the rock behind her. And maybe heal herself. If she gets a turn, which she may not now. Alright, so now we're on a time limit. Uh, let's start winning then. Uh, you. Man, I don't know what it is that's like making the frame rate choke, but. There's something. Oh, that trolley was erotic. I didn't even know. Ooh. Uh, Berserker should be able to get everybody. If I can get where I'm trying to be here. I, I can definitely get these two. 
don't think I can get them all. Uh, so we'll just take these two. And drag them over with everybody else. Um, there we go. Knock him out. I don't think we're going to have any problem here. Uh, wind, ice, wind, fire, fire. Be your fire. There. You are finished. Alright, and. That. Those three out, and now it's just what two guys, and in a second it's going to be one. Now it's one. Uh, mega bonus. Here you go. Man, the merchant sucks. Can I get him? No. Oh, actually. Oh, I'm so close. And... He was weak to, like, ice or something, right? Yeah. So we'll just come over here and smack him. I uh, we'll need to move over. Got the bomb, which is kind of cool. Oh, he's weak to ice. Here you go. There we go. There's some real damage. Got the brick. Um. Yeah, let's do burst slash. Oh. Let's get as close as we can here. There we go. Let me. First. Alright. Nice and easy. Get our cutscene. You weaklings! If you can't drive them away, you're going to lose your environment! Why are you looking at me like that? What are you... I'm doing this for you guys! Alright, uh, I should probably go back and heal since Morona is, like, dead. There we go. And then, whoops. I trust I don't need to save as long as I summon the pile of guys. So we'll just try and grind it as much as we can. Do you think Mr. Canary is alright? I don't know, but he asked for it. <laughs> Those monsters were really mad. I'm worried about him. <laughs> Somebody please help me! He sounds fine. It's Mr. Canary. We have to help him. No, oh, he's doing alright. Uh, well, none of those are Mr. Canary. Alright, so we've got another trolley. An extreme trolley. Okay. Battle is split into different groups here. My hero, Deadwood. There's that guy in the middle, too. And he's got what? Experience 2 from this guy? No, he's giving experience 2 to a couple people. Money 2. He's giving mana 2. Okay, so let's head over there. We'll start confining. The bone is going to get Cinderella. That's gonna get the archer. This is gonna get Love Deluxe. It. This will be our first three guys here. Smack him and move over. And why is she not? Oh, she got a ton of HP from being confined to the icy. Take that guy out, move over there a little bit. Man, the frame rate is totally choking, I don't know why. 
but I'll fix it between episodes. Need to fire a little bit. Not by much. Oh man, this guy's coming right toward me. So is this one. Good. Okay, uh, he's also more weak to ice. And... Can't really confine anybody new. Just angle slash him to death. There we go. And we'll move back. We'll burst here. And where we are. Because it looks like they're all going to beeline for Marona since she's so significantly weak compared to everybody else. Fire. Oh, he's he's equipped him now. In that case, they will go down together. Unless they kill Marana here. No, Marana's got the resistance. She's fine. Angle slash. Knock the little one out. Almost kill him, in fact. Or I can just kind of do whatever to him to kill him. Uh, where's the one that's still alive? That one. Had him for a second there. Yeah. Uh, move up here. Oh, nothing in range? That sucks. Okay, start smacking these guys dead. He's weak to ice. He's weak to fire. He's not, so we'll fire. There. And we'll take the wind damage, that's fine, I guess. As long as Marona doesn't die on this turn, it doesn't look like she will since they're attacking other people. Okay. Let's kill this guy. And then we'll confine... ...here. Let's do it. Uh, and... He was weak to ice a ton, right? So let's ice him. Didn't kill him. So we'll come up here and as a precaution we'll summon one more person. Uh let's maybe. Do it. But I think we'll be okay. Since it's just the one guy left. And he was weak to what? Wind? Wind and ice. Well, weak to ice, just didn't resist wind. Come here. There we go. Easy fight. Even though we're only barely above them in level. Let's return home. Heal up, because somebody fell over. And uh, I think that's going to do it for today's episode. So thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button. Share your support. It helps a whole lot. And if you want to see more from the channel, make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye for now.